Oh, we're live. What's up? Welcome to a new video. We are going to do our nursery reveal today. Oh man, what could it look like? <laughs> We've already sort of shown it in vlogs, but I have the whole process of creating her nursery in this video. And it's wild because we did this nursery reveal with Asher. We started in this bathroom and he was wearing the same outfit. Well, not the same because hers says made in Nashville. She's Franco too. <laughs> Isn't that cute? And it's the same crib. Oh yeah, yeah, a same little hand-me-down. Yeah. Oh, a little smile, huh? Oh, I remember in that vlog too, we made little jokes about having another baby. It was like a little bit of foreshadowing. We're like, oh, if it's a girl, what are we gonna do? We can save the crib for another baby. Well, there you go. And also this uh, is gonna expand as he gets bigger. I do oh believe. yeah, it could turn into a bed or we could just get him another bed and use this for the next baby. Oh my gosh. I, I want a girl one day too, but like this room is already done up. We'd have to completely redo it pink. Wallpaper over it. Or we could leave this as his room and then make another room a nursery. Recycled. <laughs> and we did the same thing we said too because we ended up using that room. Originally we thought we were gonna have to reuse that one for the nursery. But she has to wear all of Asher's clothes. I thought she would, but she's actually just getting so many gifts that she's got so yeah. many. And it is fun to dress her up in cute things. In pink! I get to put she pink. Is, she is just staring me down in this intro. Give him a kiss. Make sure you subscribe. All right. The big reveal. You ready for the big reveal? All right, Violet. You come see my room. I remember sitting in this chair with Asher too. <gasps> Ready? <laughs> you smiley butt. Ready? Whee! There you are. Who's my princess? Who's my princess? So this is really special because each of these are from David's grandma's. This is from Grandma Yampolsky. It was hanging on her walker. And this is from Grandma Frank. And the beads. Actually, this is made from the beads from her mother's necklace, so your great-great-grandmother. And not quite so ancient, but all these beautiful little Tinkerbells are from my collection when I was a little girl. So this is from things that used to be in Mommy's room. All right. So it all worked out perfectly. We didn't have to change Asher's room much. We'll show that in a minute. But we kept his moon and his stars and we just created her own room in here. Dad turned what was our guest room into this beautiful, lovely pink oasis of girliness. Thanks, Dad. You're welcome. Putting together the dresser for my <laughs> my granddaughter. She'll be here in December. She's gotta have a dresser. Yeah. She'll come out and go, where's my dresser? <laughs> Papa put this together. And our guest room is now a way smaller cute bed. <laughs> I remember dad saying it was harder to disassemble this and reassemble it in here than building the actual toddler bed. Like, yeah, this looks like a nightmare. Do I you remember putting I, this together with me? Um, no, it was traumatic and my brain blocked it out. <laughs> well, I was very pregnant with Asher and we did this. Dad was impressed <laughs> when he had to rebuild this. Like, wow, you guys did a good job. Hi, Asher. Hi. Whoa, you're silly. Silly. Let's piece her together. Okay. Thanks, Dad. You're welcome. 
This is a cute little it's bed. Awesome, it is, it's amazing. Asher, are you excited, baby? Excited. Excited, this is your new bed. It's all for you, baby. <laughs> so he was saying, this is Asher's bed. No, she had to tell him Asher's getting a new bed, which is okay. It doesn't tell you exactly where to put it, it just kind of shows like one on kind of each end and one in the middle. He's probably a little confused. Yes. He's like, why is my stuff getting moved around? Oh. <laughs> oh. Oh, he's sleeping. I love you, sweetheart. We got Asher's second mattress for the pullout that I'm going to expand. We're gonna set this room up and make it nice and nice and cozy. Can you say nice and cozy? <laughs> cozy. <laughs> You're so silly. Mm. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, that's cool. That's cool. Thank you. <laughs> Making the nursery was something that we did over multiple steps. Remember, somewhere in there, I went on tour. You went on tour, but when you were back on your break, we picked out the paint color and got a lot done when you were back from tour. Decisions, decisions. Right now we're looking at paint colors and it's, I'm overwhelmed. <laughs> I pulled a bunch of selections while David was gone so that we could look while he was here. And now it's just like, maybe I grabbed too many options. I think, I think this one looks like it's gonna be you. Mad about pink? Mad about pink, there it is. Not sponsored. <laughs> Excuse me, ma'am. I wanted it. Employees only. I wanted to keep it. Okay. Alright, we got dad painting the trim and then when David gets home we'll use the rollers to do the wall. But I really like this pink. <laughs> Let's go, mommy! Thanks, Dad. What? So thanks, Dad. You're welcome. Very exciting. Today is the day. I'm nine months pregnant. We finally paint the nursery. Welcome back from tour. Thanks. Uh it's nice to be back. Um You ready so, to paint? Yeah, we're gonna paint the nursery right now. And so I asked if she wanted to have some champagne, not sponsored. It's because... non-alcoholic, guys. Do you like your mimosas strong? Yeah, really strong. <laughs> All right, making progress. I think she likes it. And I think my favorite thing that we did was remember the decal? I do remember the decal. That was really, really tough. Okay, in her nursery and almost everything is done right now. On that wall, uh, we have her name, Violet, and a purple butterfly to go next to it. And it's gonna look really cute. And this is the decal. Look at this. I hope you like your name. It's something I just, I, I, there's nobody that I know named Violet or anything. It's just, I always thought it was such a beautiful name. I don't know, <laughs> obviously middle name, Adriana was my grandmother's name, so that's special. This is her little, oh my gosh, so this is the butterfly. Oh, I feel so huge. I'm ready for her to come on out. <laughs> okay, so we lined it up a little different than the picture. I think this is cool. Oh, that's gonna be pretty. So pretty. It's pretty. 
we did a good job. Not bad. <laughs> good job, Dada. Centered perfectly. I think we put the butterfly in the perfect place, and I think it's perfect. There we go. Got to put her new crib sheets on, but that looks nice. Asher, you want to come see your sister's room? <laughs> get up. You said you didn't want to nap, and now you won't get up, huh? <laughs> you take the stairs. And come see your sister's room. It's pretty. Meow. <laughs> What do you think? When we put it up there, it was actually just a caterpillar. <laughs> that was a metamorphosis joke. What do you think, dude? You like it? <laughs> I like it. <laughs> I like it. Thank you, baby. Hope she likes it. But yeah, my dad did a lot. He even hung up those mirrors and came up with like that cool design. I was just gonna put them straight and he decided to like, Make it all like angled and cool looking. Asher was also a really big help. <sighs> yeah, he's uh, super helpful. <laughs> I would not have thought of this outline, but I like it. Yeah, I don't like that. Butterfly. Butterfly. Yeah. This. Yes. You know, like, you know, like they're better? Because that lamp does take up a little bit of space. You know what I mean? Look at Asher. He's, he's helping figure it out. Good job. All right, Dad came up with a cool design. Hi, buddy boy. He <laughs> see Is that very loud? Yeah. Is that where that goes? Let's follow his face. Guys, <laughs> you want blue or you want? This is so cute. Okay. There you go. I remember being very, very pregnant and doing final touches, like the little mobile on there and organizing her closet. I did my best. This is her closet. I'm working pretty hard at organizing everything, trying to make everything fit and look nice. Not always the easiest. All right, last thing I want to do to put together this little mobile. That's adorable. I remember rushing all this thinking that she was going to be early and then she was a week and a half late, just like her brother. Ah, <laughs> uh, the chaos. <laughs> Shh. Well, it's my due date. Clearly not going to happen, but uh, there is one last thing that her nursery needs, um, which is for me to put the sheets on the bed. That's cute. I was like uncomfortable and ready for her to be out. And here she is. And here her room is. But that's not all. We also have Asher's room.
it looks really beautiful. This room actually looks really cool at night too with all the lights going and stuff. So Asher's very lucky. You know, he's got his drum kit in there. Hey, baby. So we just woke up from a nap. Now Dada is gonna put some cool lights around your new drum. <laughs> you excited? <laughs> we worked very, very hard on all of this. Yeah. And dad also worked. <laughs> Thanks, Dad. And so did Violet. She had to do a lot of work. She was in there growing all by herself and stuff, you know? See her smiling through the cracks. <laughs> Thanks for watching the nursery reveal. Precious memories. Cute that she's wearing the same outfit in the same crib. Family of four plus one dog plus 9,000 cats. There's more on that later. Yeah. There are 9,000 cats. Say bye-bye, Violet. Bye-bye.